Well, I must say, I am surprised. I knew that tea would have some effect on you, but I did not see that happening. I knew it. I could tell there is something different about you. Oh, as if. From the look on your face, I can already tell. It's not true. You really enjoyed yourself. And you know what? That suits me just fine, because that means we'll have to do it more often. But, if you had asked you to keep watch outside, to make sure that nothing happened to you, to make sure everything was all safe, and that's just so boring, I didn't want to do that. Nothing comes near here. There are wards, there are charms in place. Nothing will come here that means any ill intent to those who live here. Because I made it that way. Because I made it so. I was satisfied as you look. You also look very tired. I'm going to highly, highly suggest that you stay here. I'm going to wait for Drelka to get back. Oh, welcome back, sister. I see you're still in one piece. I assume that means your trip went well. Yes, it did. Why did you just come out of the tent? I asked you to stay outside and watch him. How can you do that from inside? Oh, come on now. You know I don't need to be inside to keep an eye on things, and you know that I have all sorts of, all sorts of ways of keeping my place safe. I think I have a question that's more important than any question you have. Did you know that this human is not your typical human? Well, yes, the typical humans don't fall into pitfall traps. And is that really all that you noticed? You didn't notice anything else about him. Nothing unusual. The way the light reflects in his eyes. It sounds like you're fishing for something you already know. Could you just do me a favor and tell me what you saw? Oh, but where's the fun in that? No, oh, I haven't had the opportunity to tease my little sister with something like this in a very long time, and I think I'm going to enjoy it. I'm going to see how long it takes you to figure it out, and in fact, how about we make a bet? A bet. I don't think you have anything that I want. Tomorrow morning I'll be leaving and be out of your hair. So I don't see anything you could offer me, and I don't trust anything you'd ask for in return. It's actually very smart of you, because I see that you've learned a lot from our childhood. You're not as easy to pull one over on as you used to be. Alright. How about this? Instead of a bet... Instead of a bet... I'll just hold it over your head until you figure it out. Then you don't owe me anything, and you can feel better about that. But I still get to have my fun. Can you at least give me some sort of hint? You cannot sit there and tell me that there is something unique about this human and refuse to elaborate. Oh, yes, I can. And then I just did. And by the way, he's perfectly safe. If a little worn out. You might want to stay here until morning. You probably wouldn't make it very far from him otherwise tonight. Fine. That is... Well, that is wise. Did you do what I think you did? 
On second thought, I don't even want an answer. Well, that's good because I don't think you would like the answer. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, if you would be so kind as to move out of the way, I would like to go in and check on the human. And I would appreciate it if this time you do keep watch outside the tent. Yeah, 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 fair is fair. I will watch outside the tent. No, I don't need to be outside the tent to watch. A uh, word of advice, though, before you do, little sister. Keep him awake, at least for a little bit. He's, he's going to need that. To help his body process things. Alright, I guess I'd better ask then. Which tea would you give him? Oh, you know me so well. Why don't you take a guess? You know, I don't think you'll even need to, because as soon as you get in there, you're going to know which one it was. It's very obvious. We've both had quite the draining day. Are you alright? Are you sure? Oh, uh, well, I'm not surprised you heard us when we were just outside. Yes, I see. But you are unharmed. And that is, at least, better than if you had been left at the village by yourself. I'm not overly worried about that. Oh, she is. But she is also very right. And... She told me something. Something I didn't... Something I didn't expect, and I would very much like to hear from you. <laughs> no, I can already tell from the, um, state of your clothing what has happened. No, I'm more interested in... Something she said about your eyes. Well, that's just it. I don't know. But I would like to figure it out. Or bickering goes back. Like any family, really. Yes, I would find things, and she would take them. Well, I absolutely expected she would try something like that. But what I didn't expect was for her to tell me that there is something different that makes you not like the other human. Well, yes, we had talked about that before. You didn't... You didn't try to run. Which is unusual. I would have expected humans to run. And you did not. And my sister... Drelma... She likes to take things that I find, but she is also, she's also always right. If she sees something within you, then it is there. And she is our shaman. 
We respect her knowledge, her wisdom. Two things I am not particularly skilled in, but she is. By the way, that tea that she gave you, do you know what that was? Do you know what it was for? As I imagine you have quite a few context clues after everything that happened. Mm. Hey, I just want to interrupt to say something. Please do. Since you won't leave us alone. Can we help you? Oh no, not at all. I'm just bringing in one last cup of tea. Oh, it's nothing like the last one. This one's her sleeping. You don't have to worry about that at all. I would like to smell it first. Of course, go right ahead. Here you are. You do have quite the trip tomorrow. Heading back to the tribe, yes? And I'm going with you. No, I don't think you are. You need to stay here. No, I'm going with you. Wherever he goes, I go. And this is your price for helping. You said you wanted to share. You did not say you wanted to stay with him. This is not what I agreed. Well, lucky for me, if you want my help, you're going to agree to this anyway. What do you think? Fine. You can come with us and we leave first thing in the morning. Perfect. Oh, and his pants are over there, by the way. Thought you might want to know. I'll see you tomorrow. siblings, brothers, sisters. So you know what I mean. Would you like to come over here? Or... I agree it might be easier for me to move over there. I know she can be quite pushy and quite a lot. How are you? Good. Good. I'm very, very glad. We can discuss that in the morning. There's nothing very dangerous, nothing... Nothing critical, nothing urgent. Just standard scouting. I can fill you in more. For now. For now, I think you could really use some rest. This tea really is just for sleeping. I will drink some myself. I'm glad you're safe. I wasn't worried that anything from outside would get you. I know she could protect you from that. I told you so myself. I was more worried what kind of mischief she might get up to. No, you need rest. You can fill me in in the morning.
Hello everyone, Star here, and I just finished recording Orc 7. Uh, I usually cut this part out. We're currently sitting at almost 26 and a half minutes, and we're going to see where we are after editing. I feel like I, it's going to be longer than last time, probably. Um, I also wanted to record a couple more things today, so I'm going to go ahead and get started on those. However, before I do, I want to say a big, big, big thank you uh, to everyone who watches and listens this far into the video. And an extra massive thank you to all of my patrons on Patreon who are signing up to send money to support my channel, even though I haven't finished setting my Patreon, Patron, Patreon. Even, you can shut up. Even though I haven't finished setting up my tiers the way I'd like them to be, people are, people are still signing up and that's so amazing to me. Like, it still blows my mind. I have three, 3,200 subscribers now. I'm, monetize I'm making money off of this and it's still just it blows my mind to think I'm sitting here in a chair talking into a microphone for 30 minutes and people like it it's thank you all of you I'm gonna go ahead off to get more recording done oh wait a minute before I do I want to give a big thank you out to Mr. Rickles also known as Tickles Thank you very much. I have set up the new microphone that you sent my way. I'm using it. So far, I'm loving it. We're going to see how everything comes out together, but um, I'm excited. Oh my god. It's so cool. Uh, so thank you, and thank you all for listening, and I will see you next time. Bye. Mwah.